is Democracy 2014, where we're asking the candidates in Maryland questions so you can be better informed. We're now joined by Lieutenant Governor Candidate Frida Jaffe, who is running on the Democratic ticket alongside her brother Ralph. Frida, thank you for the time today. Thank you. An opening statement, if you'd like. My name is Frida Jaffe, and I would like to thank you for giving me the opportunity to introduce myself to you. Yes, I am the running mate for my brother, Ralph Jaffe, who is running as a Democratic candidate for governor. There is a saying that goes like this, you can take the teacher out of the classroom, but you can't take the classroom out of the teacher. Now this really applies to my brother. In his past role as a formal teacher in Baltimore County, both in the public school and private school settings, and in his current role as teacher in a less formal setting. But whatever the venue is, he is first and foremost a teacher and not a politician. And he is leading a movement to get rid of all the corruption and money in, in Maryland government and bring in a new word called ethics. I also have a background in education and I've served as both a classroom teacher and school library media specialist in the Baltimore County school system for 30 years. My brother taught me that you don't have to be the conventional stereotype teacher. You see, when Ralph started teaching government, he introduced a novel way of working with his students. He made the printed words in the political science textbooks come alive as he implemented a new approach to learning called student activism in the classroom. His mission was to make student learning meaningful and consequential. Not only did the students read about the steps involved in getting a bill passed into law, but they gave birth to an idea in their classroom and actually took part in the entire process of transforming that idea into a bill, lobbying for it, and witnessing its passage by Congress and signed into law by President Richard Nixon. My brother showed me the importance of putting the spotlight and the emphasis on the student, not the teacher. The student is the heart of the school matter. The idea is to tailor the instruction to the needs of the students. And now he has converted this educational concept into political principles. Currently, as he steps into the political arena, he doesn't abandon the essence of his teaching. The student is the heart of the school matter. And so now you, the citizens of Maryland, are the heart of the matter. This is evidence in the five principles that he espouses. He refuses to take campaign contributions. He'll serve one term only. He'll keep away from paid professional lobbyists. He will tell you the truth, and he will serve free, and so will I. We're not wealthy people financially, but rather than accept the salary, our preference is to distribute this money to people and causes that really need it. Concerning campaign contributions, I can only feel astonished and appalled when I hear the dollar amounts that are designated as monies raised by these politicians in order to win an election. The staggering amount comes to at least $20 million compared to my brother's budget of $450 by design. In my opinion, collecting such huge amounts of campaign contributions is just a shameful waste of money. Just think how much better it would be to use that money for people and causes that are really in need of charitable help. For example, unemployed people who can't pay their bills, I'm sure would agree with this feeling. Concerning telling the truth all of the time, let's just look at the campaign level. If you have a TV or radio, I'm sure you've been saturated with a lot of campaign rhetoric uttered by career politicians who are seeking power and glory and fame. But the pattern is the same, a lot of words that sound good but empty promises. That's not what my brother does. He tells you the truth. The promise he will make to you is to be a good public servant for you, to serve you. Ms. Jaffe, we have to cut you off right there. Frida Jaffe, running on the Democratic ticket for Lieutenant Governor. Thank you for the time. Now to see this and other interviews, you can do so by going to abc2news.com. Click on the News tab, Been Political. You'll find all the information you need right there.